Okay, <clears throat> quick little tour. It's minus 35 here. So what I have done is I've taken off my cabinet doors. Um, I've cut some reflectives, reflectives that I can use for my windows. I'm just storing it up there. I have taken off the front storage doors. Um, I've lifted up the stove grill, um, taken that off. I need to get some of this stuff in the house or in the heated garage so that I can actually figure out uh, what I want to do with it, but it's just too cold up here to work. I can barely talk. I have cut foam for the floor. Um, my intention is just to leave that as kind of a soft, um, like insulation, but also softer for my feet. And I'll use throw rugs in here, um, but that's just, it's, I just wanted to cut and measure it. I did it on a warmer day. Um, I want to be able to, I took, sorry, I took the cabinet door off here too. Uh, I want to be able to glue like the little sides and stuff in place uh, to the rest of the foam so that I can just peel this foam out and, and clean it if I want to with dogs uh, that will be traveling with us. But um, it's so cold right now, there's just no point in doing any of that right now. Um, so I am basically taking stuff apart so I can lay in my bed when it's minus 35 and figure out what I am doing. So I am going to try to get a heat um, resistant spray and try to clean up that grill. And I want to make the front of my propane heater look better. Uh, I'm going to do something with the fridge. I'm not sure what yet. Um, and I'm trying to think of whether I'm cleaning the insulate or if I'm going to paint it. And I do have tea molding um, to fix up the stuff. I will have to do some patchwork, but um, I do have the tea molding I need to fix up all of those spots. So, but that's for another warmer day. So I've got the shelves that were in here pulled out, um, all the cupboard doors off so I can either make new ones or deal with the ones I have. But it's too cold to even hold my phone. So we'll talk to you later.